What is going on, guys? George here from the Game Marks Podcast. Welcome to the Game Marks Podcast YouTube channel, where today I'm finally doing it. We are making the jump. We are doing my rise mode. I'm very excited for this. Let us see what this has to offer this year in 2K22. I believe that we are splitting up the duties here. I believe uh, whatever division I don't do, John is going to be taking on the other one. And uh, yeah, so let's go. Welcome to My Rise between the men's division and the women's division. My Rise, you will have 10 save slots available to you. There are choices within each My Rise that can lock your character into unique paths. Feel free to make multiple characters to explore different stories. Baby, here we go. For the first time ever, we are offering two My Rise journeys. One for the men's division, one for the women's division. Both have their own unique characters and rewards to unlock. Ah, uh, who do we start with? Um, you know what? I'm gonna play both, so. So this is it. Day one of training at the WWE Performance Center. As you can see, it looks like everyone heard I was coming and decided they'd be better off staying home. This is cool, but mm -hmm. there's no right way my bat. journey ends here. I'm going to WWE and then straight to the top, where I make sure hey, that- what are you doing? You're an hour and a half early for your orientation. I was just... checking out the facility? <laughs> There'll be plenty of time for that later. How did you even get in here? Guy up front let me in. Oh, big guy with the mustache? Kind of sweaty? Yep. Well, that's Todd's final strike. Hope he uh -oh. enjoys early retirement. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna be a good guy. We're gonna stick it for this kid. Oh, no need to get anyone in trouble. He uh definitely checked my ID and even did a pat down, really thorough. So Todd's all right in my book. I feel very safe in his big sweaty hands. Jesus. Fine, whatever. Anyway, you're going to need to fill out your information on this and sign a bunch of waivers before you can begin training today. And when you're done with all that, there's actually a fun part. You get to design your wrestling gear in case you become a WWE superstar. Fantastic. You mean when I become a WWE superstar? Yeah, sure. Wait, have you been filming this entire time? Is that a problem? Filming's not allowed in here without prior consent, which you should have been told by security. Frickin' Todd. Turn it off, please. Oh, Todd. Todd's getting thrown under the bus early on. Poor Todd. All right, superstar backgrounds. Each of the four backgrounds available. You has different starting statistics, mentors, uh, mentors and stories you can interact with once this. I mean, you cannot change it, so choose wisely. Guys, we're kind of, oh, MMA background. You'll be a pro athlete. Oh, an indie or an actor? Ooh. Gotta go. Gotta go indie on this one. We'll be, we could be indie darling. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Back in our exit to the main menu and your superstar won't be saved. That's not what I wanted it. Uh, all right, so we're gonna be an indie guy who's, all right, so we wanna be high flyer. Powerhouse, striker. I mean, we're gonna, we're gonna make our best attempt at a GMP man. So, with the Sabu pose, we're gonna, we're gonna do it. We're gonna go high flyer here. Do not change it later. High flyer. No persona. Uh, wrestling. Oh wait. Oh. Wait a second. You can pick starting off points. Interesting. Entertainer. Sports. Past. Future. Formal wear. Cosplay. Battle wear, street wear, wrestling. Uh, I guess we'll go no persona for now. Oh boy. That, yeah. 
All right, accept. Okay, superstar name. Oh, no, superstar name. Uh, G M E. No, I don't want to go to another line. Space M. Oh, is it going to be all caps? Mm. No, we're going to do regular. DMP man. Uh, yes for all. Abbreviated name. Social media. Very, very uh, important. Cap. Marks. See what we're doing here, guys? Here we go at Team Marks Pod. Uh, okay, nickname. Because uh, I'm assuming that sus isn't one. Uh, can we just go none? No, you have to delete it, right? Yeah. And then we're just gonna call him G M P. That's gonna be fun to hear. Uh, yeah, he's from New York. Great. And what happens now? Do I actually make his gear or am I just stuck looking like this for now? All right. Uh, we're going to pause the recording and then when I'm done making his appearance, we'll come back. All right. So we'll see you in, uh, I guess like now. All right, and uh, we are back now with the uh, Wish version of GMP Man that I will uh, put a little bit more detail into the mask later on. Uh, yeah, rocking the the shirt. The gear is is, is pretty. I'm I'm okay with it. Got to add a couple more details to it. The mask, obviously, not what it's supposed to be. Um, but for you know what, for right now. It will do uh, personal information. We did the name thing, the menu screen pose. Uh, we'll just, uh, we'll set one. They have one where, oh, that's a funny one. Uh, let's see, we'll go with, what's a very, Luchador. He, he had one where he was like, look, it's me when I'm holding the controller. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, that one. That one's good. Because it looks like the picture when I'm holding the controller. And that's what, that's what he would be holding too, right? Because, yeah, got the white boots because that's the Johnny Clash special. Got to do that. Uh, I don't care about signs. That's fine. Side plates. Uh, what do I pick? I can't do custom side plates, can I? No. Uh, mm, uh, uh, um, side plates, huh? Guess we'll just go with, um, uh, generic WWE ones. But we're gonna go with Attitude Era. Yeah. Oh, wait. Actually, those are, that one up there is way better. Let's just go with that. That's way nicer. Cool. There's my side plates. All right. I think he's done. Hope I don't have to do his move set. Uh, performance. Uh, performance. Uh, how's that? Yeah, that. Yeah, he's a luchador. That's perfect. Um, yeah. We're going to be a good guy. It's fired up. Warming up. Fighting spirit. World's strongest man. 
Yeah, fired up's fine. Signature move. German suplex. Followed by Ripcord Lariat. I mean, that's got to be it, right? How, how does how does my character of GMP Man not have? Oh, but a million little forearms is also pretty great. Shit. Uh, we're gonna do Ripcord. Salida del Sol. Spear. Batista bomb. End of days with a sharpshooter. Salida del Sol definitely makes the most sense, but I've always thought the end of days is a cool move because it builds off Canyon's finisher of the Flatliner. Statistics! Uh, none. Resiliency, escape pin, low blow, poison mist. Come back, blackout to teleport behind, move thief, power the punch. Oh man, poison mist. Oh, I get disqualified though. Yeah, move thief is the way to go. All right, okay, okay. Uh, except. Training under Booker T, I didn't even read that. After training under two-time WWE Hall of Famer Booker T, you paid your dues in the indie scene. Uh, honing your craft into WWE scouts took notice now that you've proven yourself on the small stage Spotlight will only get bigger. Do you have what it takes to jump from indie prospect to WWE superstar? I think that uh, GMP man has the, the ability You're about to say remember there where well, you could adjust the rest of your appearance somehow you cannot edit your body type No, we're good We're good Okay, screen has changed, and now, that- You done with all that yet? Oh, that's just Just me. finished. It takes time to design a look like that. That's just me mm, with no hair. I've seen worse. <laughs> so now what? Should I go wait at the front desk with you until it's time to start? Front desk? What do you think I do here? I'm Corey Klein, head recruiter and occasional babysitter of people who don't follow instructions and show up way earlier than they're supposed to. Oh, that Corey. I guess when we were emailing, I just saw your name and assumed that... You know what? It's nice to meet you in person, finally. Go get changed. Then head over to the gym. The other trainees who started last week should be showing up soon. And to clear up any potential confusion on your end, they are men. Got it. Thanks. Eventually, we'll, we'll probably give him some hair so when he does the cutscenes, he doesn't look ridiculous. But for now, I wanted, to, I wanted to get into the gameplay here, so. All right. My Rise Hub. This is the My Rise Hub. You can discover new storyline opportunities from here by talking to people within this hub or by replying to posts and direct messages in your social media feed. Uh... The amount of fans you have is shown in the top left corner of any hub. You can gain more fans by completing storylines and winning matches. The more fans you have, the more storylines you'll be able to access. If you find yourself in a hub with no one to talk to, you can press the Y button to access your My Rise hub menu. Then, there, you can go to your social media feed or travel to different locations in order to find new storyline opportunities. Oh. Oh, oh, I thought for a second I could walk. I was about to lose my mind. Uh, Paragon J. Pierce. What is, hey. what's up? What's your story? Who are you? Uh, First day training here. It's nice to meet you in person. I watched a lot of your matches from Japan ever since I started wrestling. And when I heard you were here, I couldn't wait to get in the ring with you. Yeah, well, you better act fast since I don't plan on being here too long. Why is that? Because they should have never sent me here to begin with. I don't belong in the same place as a green rookie from the Indies, or some stupid former mascot. If you haven't met that goon yet, don't bother. Some stupid, stupid former mascot. Don't underestimate. don't underestimate me just because I've only competed on a smaller stage. Besides... 
I wouldn't be the first WWE superstar to transition from the indies. <laughs> yeah, well, I kind of wish you were the last. You talk a good game, but when this is over, you'll be running back to whatever backwoods indie promotion you came from. I've never run away from a challenge, and that's not going to change now. I look forward to proving you wrong. Damn. All right. Oh, no, not. Uh, Hector Flores, eh? What do you have to hey, say? Hey, new guy, right? I'm Hector Flores. Welcome to the PC. Thanks. And I'm well aware of who you are. I've watched a lot of your matches online. I'm excited to get going, especially since I heard you started last week. I started here, at least. I've been training in wrestling for years before this. It's part of growing up in Mexico. Wait, you didn't have family in the business, did you? No, where I'm from, you were either into wrestling or football. Sorry, soccer. I chose wrestling. I played soccer when I was a kid, but there weren't enough moonsaults or super kicks. So as soon as I was old enough, I started wrestling. I'm jealous you were able to get going so early. It's a blessing and a curse. You trained at Booker T School? What was that like? Uh, the math, the math moving. Booker's great. The expressions are the foundation so I needed to make it on the indies, but so it was time to take the next step. And that meant weird and off-putting, but I guess that's... He put in a word for me, and luckily WWE liked what they saw. Uh, must be nice to have that kind of support. It is, but I don't want anyone to think I only got here because of him. I'm going to prove that I earned this. All right, man. Good luck. Good luck. Okay, I've talked to both of those guys. Uh, don't you my eyes, you'll see the square arrow icon. This is the hub exit icon. When you see this icon, it means that interacting with it will ultimately ultimately lead you to exit the current hub you are in and advance the story. So when you see this icon, make sure you know you want to do in this hub section. Uh, okay, I see. So let's see. Uh, options. Uh, so this is the My Rise Hub. The My Rise Hub, in addition to using this menu to check your social media feed and travel to new locations for storyline opportunities, this is where you can customize your look, entrance, and upgrade your attributes. Uh, okay. If I could check my social media. Social media is a big part of your My Rise. Social media posts appear in your social media feed. Direct messages appear in your DM inbox. The main storylines will kick off the conversation with social media posts or DMs if you want. You only display these kickoff conversations. Use the stories filter when you access uh, with the left trigger and right trigger. Okay. Uh, as you play through different storylines, you'll see that there's a lot of opportunities to make when you're on social media. How the impact story unfolds. Uh, these choices can affect what story branch you go down and what match types you are in, and more. Message critical the storyline will automatically pop up, uh, and any extra story information will be waiting for you. In the unread social media post or DMs, make sure to check social media throughout your My Rise, especially after completing storyline. Alright, so... Look at all these people. Look at all, all these people. Alright, and there's DMs. Oh, okay, there's the Corey, Corey Klein, WWE. Cool. Right, social feed. Oh, I have to. Do I really have to check every one of these? Oh boy. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, well, that's kind of cool. Got it all brand new GMs. There's six sign stuff for the fans. Scrap Daddy and Pierce. Oh man! All right, that's everything in the social. I can upgrade my attributes already. This way, you can upgrade your superstar. All of your attributes are categorized. Different groups with 10 levels to each group. As you finish storylines, you will gain an uh, upgrade point that allows you to increase specific group to higher levels. This is why it allows you to see whatever you have to each group. This is especially useful uh, for which group 
to upgrade in order to raise a specific attribute. If I hit Y. Oh, okay, it's arm power. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I have how many points? I have a lot of points. Why do I have so many points? I have a lot of points. Wow. Oh, because of the thing. Uh -huh. Okay. And then, bam, 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 bam. Okay. Grappling, striking. Uh, yeah, okay. Sure. Spend all the upgrade points. Now, this is where... I'm gonna learn that you need upgrade points for other things too. Like to unlock moves or something. Okay, let's talk to Chase. I heard you were starting today. Big fan. Uh, thanks. thanks. I'm a big fan of yours too. How? I've never even had a televised match before. Oh, sorry. I was just trying to be polite. Ah, <laughs> it's okay. I'm relatively new to all this, but you and I have actually appeared on the same indie show in Memphis before. Really? I'm pretty good with faces, and I don't remember yours. Well, that's because you couldn't see my face. I was a mascot named Ribby. No. Oh, yeah, the Memphis minor league baseball shows. I think I saw you win a dance-off. <laughs> that was me. The best part of the job was getting to rub elbows with legends like Jerry the King Lawler. Mm. He He's found out ribby. I was training on the side as a wrestler and actually helped me get a shot here. He's ribby. Not that I couldn't have made it on my own. Uh. Look, I had some help from Booker T getting my foot in the door. But just remember, neither one of us would be here if we weren't talented. Oh, boy. True. Oh, boy. Oh, before I forget, can you sign something for me today before you leave? Sure. Just as long as you don't sell it online. Ah, well, then you know what? I can get it some other time. I'm just messing with you. If you can make a few bucks, then good for you. And literally, it might only be a few bucks. See you out there, Chase. Chase is ribby. Boy, oh boy. Look at tea. Sending DMs. Good luck on your first day. Remember what I taught you since day one. And then I say, don't do anything that will make you look bad or blow it. Uh, decisions. Two masks. Each mask signifies the type of WWE superstar you want to be. Green mask embodies heroic, trustworthy decisions. And the red mask embodies villainous decisions. The choice you make when these show up will likely change the trajectory of your My Rise story. Uh, I'm going to earn everyone's respect. Okay, cool. That was my first decision. Hooray. All right, this is in the Performance Center. I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of his WWE journey. The rest of you have heard this speech already, so we'll try to make it quick. On our first day, he did the whole ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages thing. It was awesome. We'll do the talking, Chase. I, I was just like telling Chase. him about your cool DX intro you did. Chase, what Road Dog was getting at is we are going to give you the foundation to succeed in WWE. What you do with it is up to you. Keep in mind, you will be judged at all times. The big man in the sky is always watching. Not that big man. There's a camera up there with a live feed that goes directly to Triple H's office in Stamford. The coaches and PC staff certainly have input, but ultimately, he'll decide when the time's right to bring the GMs from NXT, Raw, and SmackDown here so you can showcase your talents. <laughs> I'm ready for that now. Yeah, we know you think that, but it's not your call, big shot. Okay, now that all that's out of the way, we're gonna start with some one-on-one -on -one matches to see where everyone's at. All right, new guy? Since it's your first day, 
We'll let you choose who you want to face. Oh. Right. Uh, kind of want to wrestle the guy that thinks he's hot shit. Okay, let's get started. I do. I should have picked Ribby though. I'm just gonna call him Ribby the entire time. Okay. How come I'm not able to do anything? Yeah. Hello? Where did my controller go? My controller doesn't work. Hello? What happened? I'm so confused. Am I supposed to just get my ass kicked? I can't do anything? I guess I'm supposed to get my ass kicked. That sucked. That really sucked. I was not expecting that. Okay. 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 Uh, decision you made is to change your alignment. Now I gotta talk to him. Well, you wanted the best. And now you know what happens when you step up and face real competition. And hey, don't feel bad. A lot of other guys have lost to me. It's in the thousands last I checked. It's just one match. I'll be ready for the next opportunity to face you. I'm not gonna be around here too long. That might have been your one and only chance to impress the coaches and Triple H, and you blew it. I'm not gonna let one setback stop me from making it to WWE. And there are other ways to get noticed around here besides beating you. Uh, that's true. Like, maybe you could beat the former mascot. Or, I don't know, bake some brownies for Road Dog. He looks like a brownie guy. Anyway, as they say around here, good luck in your future endeavors. He said the thing, guys. He said the thing. He said the thing. Okay, Road Dog. Uh, check notifications, social media. Head back to my old stomping grounds this week. Uh, even with the goddess. Uh, sure. Sure. <laughs> All right. Okay. I see. I see how this is going to work. That's kind of cool. Confirm story. Yes. Okay. Let's see. Can I actually do stuff now? Oh, look at that. All of my stuff. Calf kicks. Bam. Bam. Okay. I like this. Now I actually get to play. And okay. My, my moveset is Rey Mysterio's from Showcase Mode. Yep, got it. This is gonna be... Okay, nope. Maybe it's not. Maybe just some of the same. 
Oh, big front drop kick. And oh, I didn't even get a prompt to. What up, dude? Hurricane Rana. There we go. Big drop kick. And cool. Uh, tag. Do I get to play as Alexa Bliss? Oh yeah, I do. Look at that. That's fun. Hey, you having some some trouble over there? That guy doesn't know what to do. And boom. Okay. Okay. She's almost stunned. Big drop kick to the back of the head. And then another one. And another one. Okay. And then. Bam. Okay. What's this? Another drop kick. Okay, hey, running Hurricane Rana. And... Oh! I thought he was gonna hit him with the Falcon Arrow. Ah. Oh! Oh! Do I have a springboard or anything? I do! Oh, that's fun. All right, all right. Two. All right, compression pants. Let's get back in the ring, or not. That's fine as well. Three. Come on, let's go. In the ring. Four. Thank you. Oh, oh, frog splash! I think I just broke his spine too. Oh god. Oh man, this is my guy's moveset is, is wild. Oh no! She's allowed to break up the pin, but I can't. I'm so confused. Ugh. Ooh. Uh, got extra credit homework assignment for you if you're interested. It involves picking up dry cleaning, washing your car. I'm not interested. Now, Trace already volunteered to do that. If you want to study a WWE Legends match, you can learn about just by watching it. Accept assignment. Whose match am I watching? That's up to you. Oh. I want you to visualize the face of them in the ring. Tell me what you'd like to... And what it would take to compete on their level. Macho Man, Brett, or Hogan? Ooh. I think I'm going Macho? Solid choice. Let me know how it goes. Oh, I got... Wait, can I change? What happens if I hit no? Yeah, we're gonna. St I guess we're gonna go Macho. I I like Macho. Could have gone Bret though. That was a tough choice. I also do love me some Bret Hart. So wait, now I'm wrestling Bret Hart. Can George win a match today? Coming out swinging. With two losses. So now it's... Oh. Cool. Fantasy match. And I'm actually in my gear. 
making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 226 pounds, G. Yeah, no, that's Some fans fun. first heard of this competitor when he had a tryout match at a WWE Live event. He looked great that night, but he's taking things to a whole new level now. It's a feel-good story for him, and I respect that he paid his dues, but we'll see how he handles the pressure at this moment. All right. Let me hear a... Oh, yeah! That was blatantly disrespectful, Saxon. All right, all right. Talking about one of the greatest to ever step in This is cool. The this is cool. Over and his opponent from Macho Sarasota, Man Randy Savage here. at 239 pounds. Macho Man Randy Savage. I like it. I like Randy it. Randy Savage brings the magic each and every time he enters the Ooh. ring. With Little Macho Man entrance. And agility. Often imitated. Never Looks duplicated. okay. <laughs> the terrier pill, too sweet to be sour, fuck you like a monkey. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Just when I thought you couldn't be any more embarrassing, Saxton, you even outbid yourself. Oh my goodness. Oh jeez. Alright. Uh alright. We're gonna skip this because gotta have uh streamer mode or content creation yeah, mode on so there's no the there's no music for anybody. It's very sad. Alright. Big kick to the head. It will be a tall order, but the confidence he possesses could uh, take him very rip. far. And we know it doesn't take much to get Rana. Macho Man heated. But will he be able to conserve his energy and dig down if this fight goes into the deep water? I don't think conserving energy is part of Randy's style. The oh, Mitch you know who's driving. Too like sweet that. to be sour. And you best believe he only has one speed. You're only saying that because you were in his rap video. Taking this match off the mat now. Okay. Big splash. The crunch on the the moves is new. Macho man I don't, that's new to me. And Savage is looking for a solution. Springboard moonsault. That guy makes it easy. Nope, not that. That's not the button. Savage with amazing reflexes. Oh. Oh boy. Oh, okay. No sell. He's getting a huge boost right now. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. That there. Not safe yet. And okay. Savage's full speed approach was slowed down with that move. Oh. The gear finds its mark. Oh, look at this. Oh. oh kicks. A million little kicks to the head, guys. We did it. A million little kicks. And he sends him into the corner. All right. Looking forward him up. on that top turnbuckle. What happens? What do we do here? Gonna be something good. For these two competitors. This could go Super south Plex. in a hurry. Here we go. Oh. Superplex. Love that. All right, let's see if I've got... Uh... He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. And he kind of... All right. Oh, no. Oh. oh no! Reverse! Slips out of the way there. What? Uh -oh. End of days. Alright. Alright. Hit the pin. One. Two. Alright. I beat Randy Savage. <laughs> GMP man has beat Randy Savage. Here is your winner. At SummerSlam 88. All right, that is going to do it for this episode, the first episode, very first episode of the My Rise playthrough in WWE 2K20. Hope that uh, you'll hang out with us along this whole journey here that we're going to do. I know John's going to pick up doing the uh, the other version, uh, the other My Rise story, and uh, let us know what you thought. We will see you in the next one. Game over. Hey guys, what's going on? Future George here. Uh, I just wanted to interrupt really quick and let you know that immediately after playing this match you are put into a handicap match against stone cold and the rock uh which i won uh i was not aware that that was going to happen so i ended the video a little prematurely i thought this was a good spot uh to end it but apparently 
I missed the match. So that match didn't get recorded, but I wanted to let you know that it does happen and it's uh, hard as shit at this level. So uh, yeah, thanks for, for checking out episode one of the 2K22 My Rise playthrough. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, ring that notification bell, and we will see you in the next one. Game Marks Podcast, put them on the radar. Play a rare game, Sega Saturn, no game shard. Johnny and George work hard and they play hard. Future endeavor games and put them in the graveyard. From the deep dive to the clash at the feast. How can I get more? That's question of the week. Follow on Twitch, there's nothing that they won't play. Game Marks Podcast every single Monday.